your idea? Um, my idea is this, there'll be no past tense here, um, because John's career has been, is brilliant, and his greatness is due to his courage and his foresight and his wisdom, Jim referred to it there at the end of the game. He had the wisdom to leave Manchester United when they were a top club in England, to go to Leeds United in, in the second division of the championship, to believe in Don Reddy, who was building a great team, which John partly led and largely led. Intellectually, he, he, he knew that was the time. And he, he went on to manage West Brom. Don Revy wanted him to succeed him at Leeds as the manager. Bill Nicholson wanted him to succeed him at Tottenham as the coach. He went on to manage West Brom. Won promotion, fifth in the, what well, is now the Premier League. The hottest young manager in England. He walked away from the game because he didn't like the way it was run. Responsibility without power. Managed the Irish team, changed the culture over seven years, gave Liam, Mark Lawrence and all these great players their debut, changed it forever. Came home to try and create a great club of Shamrock Rovers. Brave, courageous, foresight. It's always been his hallmark. And in the 30 years he sat in that chair, if any of these kids out there wonder, who's that guy? That guy is the greatest football man we've ever had and has nearly ever been in these islands. And it's going to go on. For the Herald and for News Talk, I'll be tuning in. I'll be buying the Herald. He's a great, great friend of all of us. A joy to work with. And a great, great figure in the history of Irish sport. A soccer's man. Beautifully put. Beautifully put. Uh, Liam, you've known John such a